but it may be of interest to you to know that I um, was acquainted with C.S. Lewis um, in my time at the University of Oxford, both as a student and a graduate student. Um, I went frequently to meetings of the Socratic Club, an organization which he founded and for certainly through most of the 40s and the 50s chaired. Uh, you might also be interested to know that in his later life, uh, he became very distressed about evil uh, because basically he was confronted with the choice. Uh, are things uh, good because God says so? Or does God approve of them because they were good? Mm -hmm. And he couldn't see the way out of any way other than saying that absolute power is its own justification, as Calvin and others said. And in view of the fact that uh, the traditional religion is committed to the idea that most of God's creatures are going to be tortured forever for the things that he <coughs> makes them do, the, the whole of Christian theism is a nightmare to me. And one of the reasons why I am so concerned about these arguments, because I see the existence of the Christ as a nightmare. Because far from being good the, on the actual record, and if you say only Calvinists believe this, I can refer you to the passages in Aquinas where he says that God created people and is the ultimate cause of including of the behavior for which he is proposing to torture them forever. Yeah.